Hey everyone, in this video I will show you how to automate data validation in Excel using Python Open by Excel package. Here is scenario. I have a project plan file which tracks task, owner of the task and current status. The issue here is people are entering the status of the task in their own terminology. Some has entered in progress, others are saying it's completed or complete. Uh, in short, the status column is all over the place. I want to make sure people can only enter certain value or ideally select from existing list of values so I can maintain integrity of this project plan. In actual, we can do that using something called data validation and we will automate that data validation using Python. Let's go back to Python file. First thing we will do is import packages. In this case, we will need OpenPyXL and data validation package which is part of OpenPy Excel. Now we will get our Excel file using load workbook method and grab our Excel sheet. Since it has only one sheet, uh, we can use wb.active method. Now we will define a list of options that should be selectable in status column. In this case, I want three options, not started, in progress and completed. We will need to add this in very specific format. First, we need to wrap all three option inside double quotes and then with the single quotes because that's the required format for this to work. Now we will define our data validation and pass type and the required option. In this case I will use type equal to list and in formula 1 we will pass our predefined option and we will allow blank to be true so people can either keep it as blank or select value from a predefined options. Now we will add some additional option. First we will add error message. For that we will set error and error title. In this case we will display a message your entry is not valid if user try to enter something other than our predefined option and the error title uh, it will appear as a pop-up and that pop-up title should be invalid entry. Second we will add prompt as well to display a message while control move to status column. So let's define prompt and prompt title. Now we will need to use add data validation method to insert our validation rule in seat and then add exit cell location where we want this rule to be enforced and finally we will save this excel file in this case i wanted to save this as a new file so i'll pass file name as file.xlsx so i'm expecting new files to be generated with this name let's save our code and run it and as you can see we have new file generated called file.xlsx let me open that file and as you can see our status column is displaying some prompt if we hover over it. Also, if we try to enter some value now, let's say I wanted to enter in progress again as a seam, it will display in our error, your entry is not valid with the pop-up which is named as invalid entry. If I go back to my code now, you can see we have defined our error message, your entry is invalid. And here in Excel, we are seeing that same message. So this status column now has to be updated with the three options we provided. And there's also a drop down here. You can click on it and then select a value from the predefined value. And then you can save this file. So next time anyone comes to this file, they cannot enter any new values. They have to select it from the existing value only. So that's how you can add data validation in Excel using Python OpenPy Excel module.